the skills and the perks being reverted back to normal literally feels like I just woke up from a bad dream. Since multiclassing was out, dude, I swear I probably lost two years of my life with the freaking amount of cortisol that was spiked in my freaking blood. Now I could finally go back to being the best Slayer fighter in the world, undefeated. But the first thing we're gonna go ahead and buy. We're doing the dashing boots with additional move speed and dexterity. And if you can find a piece with some HP, like something like this. If you can't afford the Vigor, you can buy something like this, which is three dexterity and five additional move speed. Also, the projectile damage reduction doesn't hurt. We're gonna get this one. Up next, we're going to be doing the Dark Leather Leggings. And I found one right here for 1,000 gold, 2 dex, 3 agility, 1 will, 5 fist power. This is exactly what we need. 30 magic resistance is everything we need. We get this. And coming up, we're going to be doing the Dooblet. Get some agi on there so we can at least get like 100% move speed without weapons. 5 dex, 3 agi, 5 fist power. Looks good to me. And the leather cap with some magi on it as well. And this one has magic resistance, which is pretty good for us too. Get this one. We're going to be doing uh, the reinforced gloves. I'm going to get this right away because this is a very, very good pick. You can flip these for like two, three thousand gold. That guy just listed his, so that was a steal. Three dexterity, two true. Found this cloak right here. Three dexterity and five magic resist. Two true and 2.1 action speed. I'm going to jump for this. We're going to be doing ring of courage with two true. And this is probably a good budget pick, but I'm going to go ahead and use my grim smile rings, which is just like an upgraded ring of courage just comes with five strength and i got these two true here if you want to go this route they're about two thousand gold each and the cool thing about it is it does add a significant amount of hp as well and for the neck piece i'm going to be purchasing something like this x hp 7 3.3 action speed and two true you can get three true if you want but it's pretty damn expensive i'm just gonna sell it for two arming sword will do us just fine this build i have this arming sword in my inventory three max hp 37 weapon damage and you can never forget about that cyclops vision crystal hopefully we find one with health bonus on it like this one we're gonna go for hp so we'll get this and we're gonna be doing a windless crossbow with max damage rolls that way we can negate the 10 percent and this one's very very good that 10 percent physical damage bonus boss from the uh, weapon mastery perk excellent one as for the recurve bow, it's just going to be a very cheap one. We don't want to spend anything too expensive on a recurve bow. This is just a tool. We're just going to drop it later. Dang, that increases the gear score significantly. I think we're going to get some dead lobbies. You know what's going to also increase the gear score significantly? Buying freaking green pots. These are expensive as hell. We're going all in today. 200. These were 400 earlier. A Francesca axes, can't forget them. 802. Kind of ridiculous. Ridiculous gear score. We got 131 HP, plus 3, plus 1.1%. 98 move speed. 20 action speed, plus 15. 22 damage reduction. 20 magic resistance, which does seem low. This number will make or break you. That's why we're wearing these two. 20% power bonus. Not bad. All right, let's give it a go. Go ahead and see what we're doing. <laughs> That's very decent. 140 HP. 37 action speed. This also adds some action speed as well, which is really cool. 2 dexterity. And 22 power bonus. You got a warlock over here. I'm gonna try to put some distance. Hey, he's got some good MS. Let me just get rid of this mob. Okay, he's fighting other mobs. I think I'm going to try to get on top of this. Hopefully he doesn't see us. Maybe he can see the crystal ball. Not crystal ball, Cyclops Vision Crystal. I'm going to rush him. I think I can tank some Flame Walker. Yeah, we're gonna have to do Kobe Bryant. Let's freaking go. Oh, dude, that's literally the dude who killed us yesterday. You guys remember that epic fight on stream? We definitely wised up. We stacked that magic resist. Can't get too far without ice shield, huh, buddy? GG's brother, I told you I'd get you. Literally killed me like freaking three times yesterday. It's about damn time. 
203 HP without rage? You on the left? Think I'm gonna rush him? Decent, but no gear. Try to find this barb. Holy! Okay, I gotta get distance. Oh, he's gonna wait for Savage Roar. One winless is GG. Oh, man. I'm just gonna drink the troll bug. Probably a bad second wind. Really bad second wind. Holy hell, I can't believe I got him. Oh, that's freaking true damage. Ah, damn it. I never get to get the juice kills, bro. I'm gonna wait in the zone. He's not gonna push me. I don't think he'll push. Alright, I think the coast is clear. Yeah, I'm just gonna get it and dip. Dude, let's go. Looks like a ranger. Wait, he's probably got traps. Maybe? Hey, what is he doing? Wait, what? Oh, he's gonna do a turnaround. There's another guy here. Uh, this is the ranger. Other dude is a fighter, slayer fighter. Got a ranger. No traps. Death by Francesca. It is always one way to do it. Oh man, he's looking decent. He's looking real decent. Got another guy here. Freaking wizard. But this guy was casting pretty fast. I saw him in the lobby. The one windless is GG. Like, actually. That's not a windless. Pretty sure I hit him. If he's running away, I think I hit him. Oh, nope, 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 nope. I've made that mistake before. We get distance. Nope. I probably should drink a potion. Holy hell, there's no way. Magic resist. I guarantee you that 20% is doing a great deal. He's looking alright. Pretty good. I think that's a uh, crystal ball. No, no, no. Cyclops Vision Crystal Slayer Fighter. With a rapier? Let's freaking go, dude. Pretty much Slayer Fighter versus Slayer Fighter. Whoever hits the, uh, the windless first wins. If he hits me, I'm gonna back off. GG. Literally GG. Oh shit! Arming sword diff. Yeah, so I did the rapier build too. I just realized the arming sword is just better. Pretty sick. 10% damage bonus loss is kind of not worth it.
I think there's a rogue around here. Ruby, silver, duplet, rogue. Creeping around. Hey, he's right there. Oh, Francesco. Decent. This guy was juiced. Looking pretty sick. Cool thing is, is, uh, everything counts as looted now once you pick it up. Here's to see how much dexterity demon clack leggings go for. Round 299, pretty damn cheap. This does have resourcefulness, so I'll just go 300. This Ruby Super Duplet, all attributes three will. All attributes one will is a thousand gold. I'll go 1399. Grim Small Ring with magic healing, around 400 gold. It also has max HP, so mine should go. Three fist power Grim Small Ring, around 700 gold. Garamino. Action speed and max HP. 3 max health is 1200. I'll probably think this is probably will go for 699. Additional physical damage, Grave Wolf. 697. Go 499. Legendary Crystal Ball. Yeah, I'd say around 500 gold. All attributes, Brave Hunters. Around 1500 gold. Go 1300. Fox Pendant with all attributes and 3 additional physical damage. Around 1000 gold. Quick Cell, 899. Adventure Tunic with 3 Knowledge. Curious to see how much this goes for. Around 600 gold. Go 499. Thank you guys very much for watching today. I had a blast with this build. I'm going to grind for maybe 3 or 4 more kits. And then we'll get streaming. And we'll see you then.